I remember vividly in 1997 sitting in Miss Buckham's French class in middle school and my friend Julie was sitting next to me and she was singing something I'd never heard before. She was singing, creation, vacation, mucho masturbation. And my little gay ears perked right up uh, because those two lyrics were a pretty uh, accurate description of what I was up to in the seventh grade. And I didn't know then how much Jonathan Larson's words and music would come to mean to me. I was a closeted Indian kid going through puberty in the 90s, and so my very first sexual stirrings and private longings got kind of tangled up in all these whispers I was hearing about gay men and AIDS. So I think sex and death sat very close together in my adolescent brain. And then my parents and I went to see the touring production of Rent in Boston. And I remember just like, here was this musical with all of these feelings that just burst out of it. And it made all of my two big teenage emotions feel somehow romantic and sexy instead of ridiculous. And now I could sing about them with all the other choir kids around the piano when somebody sat down and plunked out those first iconic chords of Seasons of Love. I was a baritone, so I sang I'll Cover You reprise for every audition ever. And it's wild to think about the fact that that was available to me, that in Lily White suburbia, I somehow had access to this beautiful elegy sung by a black man to his brown femme lover. Jonathan Larson made something that quite literally changed my life. So when my collaborator Laura and I found out we had received a Jonathan Larson grant back in 2022. It was really the most mind-blowing and humbling experience. And I'm so glad that I have this opportunity now, two years later, to express my deep gratitude to the Larson family and to the American Theater Wing for um, this huge honor. I also want to thank my parents and my partner Cameron for always helping me think through my weird ideas. And of course, I wanna thank my co-conspirator, Laura Grill J for this journey we've been on for over a decade now, writing musicals together. I'm so moved that we get to be a part of Jonathan Larson's legacy and participate in this epic experiment that is musical theater.